as you talk about um, the, the, the big ministries that do the children's care, like Compassion and World Vision and those, that's amazing. I was a Compassion sponsor for many, many years until Child Beyond came along and I, of course, shifted my focus. But ultimately, they're, they're ministering to mostly families and children within those families to make sure they stay healthy, strong, bring the gospel, all those beautiful things. But we're the ones that have the great humble privilege of catching the ones that are falling through the cracks, those that have no parents, those that have lost their parents. I, I think of our, one of our first little babies that came to us back in 2006 when we first opened our children's home, that her name was Angela and her father in, in a rage shot her, his mo her mother in front of her, blood splattered on her whole little kitty shirt, killed him shelf next, and she was found wandering the streets crying. And, and so she came to us and we, by God's grace, she, rest, she was rescued by us through the government. They brought her to us and, and God in his mercy restored Angela emotionally, physically not, you know, she wasn't unhealthy, but physically, emotionally and spiritually. And then we got her a forever home. We released her into her forever home. And now we have this reinforcement piece where we're keeping an eye on her, making sure she's okay, making sure her family has what's needed.